Yeah. It was a one-two punch of news yesterday afternoon. And at first, we, we, look, we knew that we were going to get a production cut, and we'll talk about that with the 777. And this is usually when Boeing raises its dividend. And this was about what people were expecting. Some were saying, could we see a 50% dividend hike, quarterly dividend? No, you got 30%, which is still pretty darn good. It will now be $1.42 a share starting in the first quarter of next year. And they've also taken the current $14 billion stock buyback program, of which they had already bought back seven. They said, oh, let's replace that and add a new $14 billion stock buyback program. Essentially, they're putting their cash to work. Uh, as Mike Santoli said last night when we were talking on set, he goes, this is a nice defensive move coming after the news that they will be cutting the 777 production rate. What they're doing with the 777, and this has been expected for some time, is going from seven per month down to five per month starting in August of next year. What's interesting is that new production schedule of five per month, that includes the anticipation that the Iran sale, which includes 30 triple sevens, will go through. So if for some reason that deal does not happen and we don't see a big order coming in the near future for the 777, you could see further pressure on that production schedule. So as you take a look at shares of Boeing, and I think this is the most interesting chart because remember right after Donald Trump tweeted out about the cost of Air Force One, mm -hmm. the stock took a big hit and it has come back. Now this is since the election, but right at the end there, you saw it drop down in the last week. It made everything up by the end of the week and it continued to move higher yesterday after hours. Hey there, thanks for checking out CNBC on YouTube. Be sure to subscribe to stay up to date on all of the day's biggest stories. You can also click on any of the videos around me to watch the latest from CNBC. Thanks for watching.